Welcome to part eight of our guided meditation series. Today, we're going to explore the importance of creating space for our practice. Our meditation practice is a sort of ritual. Um, we try not to make it too fancy. Instead, come back to the basics, but what's needed is a sense of ongoing familiarity and a creation of safety and comfort to give ourselves space and time to observe what it's like to be us. We've explored a few rituals so far. I've called them techniques or tools, uh, types of meditation, but essentially they're internal reminders that what we're about to do is something quite different than what we usually do in the course of daily life in that we try to do less and to experience more. So I'm going to guide you through a few um, ritual setups, but I invite you to create your own, especially if you're practicing on your own without guidance. It's really important to create this kind of structure Else you may find that you come to sit and then 10 minutes goes by and you realize that it hasn't really been meditation, it's just been lost in thought or lost in dream. Okay, so the ritual today will begin with an orientation and let's start with a visual field. So just take a moment to look around your space where you've sat down and maybe everything's really familiar or maybe um, things have moved around a little bit. Uh, just notice where you are. Reassure yourself that this is a comfortable space and that you're safe here and that you have this time to dedicate to the inward journey. Okay, so I invite you to start to close down the external sense of sight and that can be to close your eyes partially or fully. Allow the work of your eyeballs to lessen and lessen and to make this field more simple. Also make sure that your posture is one that feels comfortable, that your body is your home, of course, and we want it to be a comforting home. So whether you're sitting in a chair, sitting on a cushion, or lying down, just take a few moments to notice a sense of peace in your body. It can be helpful to bring your hands down to something steady, your legs or your lap. And it can be helpful to form a mudra, bringing your index finger and thumb lightly together, yan mudra. Yan means wisdom. Okay. And we can call this a ritual too, how we move our attention through our body and just check in to make sure that you're not just comfortable through your seat, but also through the subtler parts of your body. So bring your attention up to your face and your jaw and ensure that your jaw is relaxed. There's actually a space held in your mouth as you let your tongue settle from the roof of your mouth. This space held in your mouth, it's like your tongue is a throne, that you're creating a, a regal space, a dignified space of practice. Allow the skin around your eyes to soften. for your eyebrows to unknit and to smooth. Okay, and then our next ritual, let's move in a little bit further to observe what is in motion in your body. In and amongst the effort to be still, there's still the pulsation of life. These things that we take for granted can really blossom in their amazingness when we allow other aspects of our life to quieten. Notice that you're breathing. And 
what a delicate nature your breath holds. If your focus becomes too rigid, then you may begin to affect your breath. Give your breath space to flow by its own nature. Remind yourself that this is meditation practice. This is time to be with yourself. Time to witness what arises within you and how you respond to it without adding anything special or trying to get anywhere different than you already are. our energy starts to move towards something in particular and we're following a train of thought or a feeling, then our focus can become really narrow. Our experience collapses down to this one element we're more or less at its mercy that everything becomes that. When or if you feel this, remind yourself of the space you set up, the space you're holding to observe the totality of you. Be reminding yourself of the feelings of breathing. Or reminding yourself of the safe space you've created to sit within. Or reminding yourself of the boundless space of your experience.
remember that you don't need to invest in anything right now. You don't need to make anything different than it already is. What you're observing exists by its own nature. You don't need to change it. Just notice what are the ingredients of this experience. What is this like? Those thoughts don't need your input right now. Take a step back. Soften. Feel your body breathe.
Thank you for your practice. Namaste.